Okay, Andrew, thank you. In the past 24 hours, 50 Michiganders have died with 680 new cases of coronavirus confirmed. Total number of cases now surpassing 46,000. The state says this week it hit a new one day record with more than 13,000 tests. Uh, only 8% of them came back positive. You may recall back in April, the positive rate was running at 40%. Other headlines, the Michigan Restaurant and Lodging Association is urging Governor Whitmer to allow restaurants to open again on May 29th once the stay at home order expires and the economic toll gets worse. 20 and a half million American jobs lost just in the month of April. Unemployment rate of 14.7 percent nationwide is the highest rate since the Great Depression. The manhunt for two men accused of killing a Flint Family Dollar security guard is now over with both men in police custody. Calvin Munnerlin was killed one week ago after telling a customer she had to wear a mask. Investigators say a short time later, 23-year-old Ramonia Bishop and 44-year-old Larry Tigg walked into the store pulling a gun on Munnerlin and shooting him in the head. Bishop was arrested today at a home in Bay City while Tigg was taken into custody in Houston. Three other people are also facing charges in connection to this deadly shooting.